everybody. Happy Monday. It is almost 12.30 in the afternoon. Another day of living the dream at Walmart. <laughs> I'm on my way to work. Uh, I'm going to try to get my video from yesterday up yet. I mean, I, I fell asleep last night. I was working on it and I just totally fell asleep. But uh, in case I don't, my day to day is pretty much like it was yesterday. I've rearranged the way I've thought about my meals. Uh, when I'm working this one to 10 shift, I eat breakfast before I go to work. This morning I had five points and I'll show that to you. Uh, and now I'm not gonna get a break until three o'clock. It's a 15 minute break. So I'm actually eating my snack now, which is uh, a cheese stick and a cup of grapes. It's the same thing I had yesterday. Only because I was super lazy and tired this morning. I didn't get anything ready till the last minute. So that's another point. So that takes me up to six points. Now my, for my lunch, um, which is going to be my fir first 15 minute break. I brought a turkey wrap. That's four points. It's got the Olay tortilla. I'm telling you this because I probably won't show it to you. Tortilla, the tortilla for one point. Two ounces of the uh, Oscar Mayer turkey deli. I'm going to it for one point. A tablespoon of Miracle Whip Light for one point and a Velveeta for one point. So that's four points. I'll take them up to 10 points. And then for my dinner break, I just brought a cup of yogurt, or zero points, and I put some kind raspberry clusters, low fat granola on it. 29 grams for four points. That takes me up to 14 points. And then for my last break of the day, which is around um, between 7.30 and 8 o'clock, I brought a cheese stick for one point and seven almonds for one point. So that takes me up to 16 points today, which is good. Uh, I also have my second cup of coffee with me, but I already tracked it with breakfast. And I'll probably be drinking on this all day. Yesterday I had a pretty good damn plan until I left work. I was just famished for some reason. And I really, I don't know if I was just hungry or overly tired and I thought it was hungry. I'm thinking it was, I was overly tired. Because I got some chicken chunks at the deli before I came home. I didn't need them. I didn't even eat them all. I mean, I ate a good portion of them. And up until that point, I'd only had 14 points. So, not too worried. My weight was still at 198.0 today. So, it probably would have been down had I not splurged so late at night. That's the trouble, you know. I didn't come, get home until 10.30, so I was eating that chicken at 10.30. I didn't need to. Tonight, I'm just going to push through that. I'm hungry, I'm going to go home and have a banana or some vegetables or maybe a, a, a small cup of soup. I don't really have the money to spend on anything anyway, so. Actually, no. I didn't have 14. I had 18 points because I did get a bag of chips out of the vending machine yesterday, too. You know, come think of it. There seems to be a direct correlation between me getting those chips and being hungry at night. Okay. So I'm not going to get the chips today. We'll see if my hunger goes away. I did talk to my boss about maybe changing my hours a little bit. Um, because this 1 to 10 shift is killing me. I mean, it, it just, I don't know if it's working so late at night or what, you know, what it is, but 
it just is wrecking me. He said he would. I mean, I said, you know, I didn't even mind working the 11 to 8 shift or earlier. But this getting home at 10.30, close to 11 o'clock at night, I just can't do it. Plus, I, and I explained to him, I said, you know, I live alone out in the country. And it makes me nervous driving home on these country roads late at night. So, anyway, plan my day out, so let's hope I can stick to this. Um, Lainey asked me if I was okay. I'm okay. I'm just tired. I'm exhausted. I had to remind myself yesterday why I'm doing this. Because, you know, I told you that I was able to make it with my bills without working. I didn't have any breathing room. And the real reason I'm doing this was, is to buy those headstones. And if I do it the way I want to, I think I have, can have it done in eight months. And then I'll reevaluate whether I'm going to keep working at least full time. Nothing on that church job yet. I'm going to, I think, wait until Monday, then email them again. I don't want to be a nuisance. Let them know that I understand their delay, because I do. I mean, I was a member of the Methodist Church, and I kind of know how they work things, but... I understand why they're delaying, but tell, tell them that I'm still very much interested in that job. So, I didn't get as many steps in yesterday, although I was doing some walking yesterday. But ever since that howling incident the other night in the backyard, I'm not staying out. I, I'm not walking around the pond at night. I go like halfway, let her do her business, and come back. Walked around once this morning. I mean, yesterday the weather was still really bad, so I did walk around once this morning, and um, we'll see how many steps I get in at work today. So I, I only did the returns for a couple hours, so I wasn't walking around the store the entire day. But I have to tell you people, I'm tired. Also, in some of the comments I made that were made on my canning video, a couple of people were interested in what I did with all that pumpkin. Well, I still make pumpkin pies at the holidays and cookies for the kids. My, um, my pumpkin spice cookies are sort of legendary. <laughs> I also make a um, zero point pumpkin pie for me at the holidays. I think I shared that recipe once before, but I'll try to find it and uh, let you know that again. But it was a Weight Watchers recipe. I found it online. It's a crustless zero point pumpkin pie. It really is like a pumpkin custard, but it's very good. So, and I also use it to, you know, anything that you would use oil for, you can substitute pumpkin puree for, just like you would applesauce, or, you know, the unsweetened applesauce. So, like that brothel recipe. Um, which I've been meaning to make again and I haven't gotten around to it. But you can substitute it in any things that you would bake to lower the calories in it. Um, sometimes I will just open up a jar and I'll make a, a pumpkin mash for dinner. You know, and you can make it either savory or sweet. So, 
That's what I use it for. And then when the kids come, you know, I can have sweets for them or whatever. And but I basically I use it to lower calories and things that call for a lot of oil. Sometimes I will do like half pumpkin, half unsweetened applesauce. That's like my next canning um, adventures. I gotta get my applesauce done. Pumpkin butter, which I explained to you in the video about canning that. I don't can it. I could freeze it if I had the freezer space, which I don't have anymore. But yeah, it's a good thing just to have on hand. And it's so pretty on the shelf. So Wednesday, I'm gonna finish up the rest of those pumpkins that I have. I have to get some jars though. running low on jars which <laughs> when my son from Mount Lima moved I had given him a bunch of canned stuff when he lived down there and so I asked him the other day uh, where are my jars oh I don't know probably in the dumpster <laughs> I have I had a heart attack I said Andrew I use those jars year after year after year which is what makes canning so cost effective that you're not buying that stuff all the time the jars that i've bought this year i'm still going to be using 10 years from now oh sorry so when he came over and got stuff out of my pantry the other day i said make sure i get these jars back We live in a, in a throwaway society. These kids don't understand a lot of stuff. Well, I'm almost at work. You know, really, I don't mind this job that much. I'm just so tired. After I get these headstones bought, I mean, I'm going to have to... I can't see myself working 40 hours a week till I'm 70 years old, you know. I know people do it. It's just I'm not going to. So, all right, well, I'll let you go. I've told you what I'm going to eat today. If anything changes, I'll let you know, but I don't think it will. So, you guys have a great day, and I will... Talk to you in a little bit. All right, my breakfast this morning, I have two, one egg and two egg whites for zero points. Two slices of the private selection center cut bacon for one point. I have two slices of the Nichols light wheat toast for two points and two points in my coffee. So one, two, three, four, five points for breakfast this morning. I just put some spray butter on my toast this morning. Well, it is another late night. I am finally home from work. Got my litter box changed. Got the garbage taken out. <laughs> I'm ready to call it tonight a night, but I wanted to get this video up. I, um, I'm i counting 23 points today. I did get something out of the vending machine. It was a, a low-fat chip that wasn't the kind I normally eat. Um, but uh, it, I scanned it at 6 points for the bag. That took me to 21, but I'm kind of munching on some roasted pumpkin seeds that I made the other night so I'm gonna count two points for those so anyway all in all a pretty good day came real close to buying some candy on the way, way out and I thought no I'm just gonna go home I thought I have something here I could make if I'm you know I could have a banana if I want something sweet but I thought salty crunchy sounded better to me <laughs> I'm going to need to take um, more to eat with me uh, for my dinner break because after dinner I'm still hungry. So um, 
I'll have to figure that out. I'm gonna go to the grocery store Thursday. And Thursday I only work I only work eleven to eight. Depending on the weather anyway, I'll go to the grocery store Thursday. Because it's supposed to be nasty here on Halloween. Which is a little bit sad for me. I I was planning on going we'll see what happens with the weather. But um I right now my plan is, is to go to the cemetery before I go into work because it's Joe's birthday. Um I may I'm watching the weather forecast closely. I may end up going there Wednesday instead on my day off. So um hopefully by the time you see this I'll have my video from yesterday up. Uh yesterday was pretty much the same same day that I had today. Except for I did have some chicken barbecue chicken nuggets when I got off work last night. So that that probably put me over the top. My weight stayed the same today, so I think I'm okay. I haven't synced my Fitbit. I don't know how many how many steps I have in finally. I think I've got about five floors in though. So but my knee is killing me right now. I was at the door most of the day. I did a few of the returns. Um but not for very long today. So I was mostly at the door, so didn't get as many steps in as what I like, I don't think. But like I said, I haven't synced my Fitbit yet, so I don't know. Another one to ten day tomorrow. It's gonna be a long day. The store was crazy busy this afternoon. So hopefully it will I mean we're almost out of all the Halloween stuff, so maybe it'll slow down the next couple days. And the weather was really nice today, so people were out and about. I'm not sure what the weather's supposed to be like tomorrow, but uh, I know that there's a system coming in. Matter of fact, they just showed a map up on the TV that showed some rain and even snow coming in. <laughs> it's snowing out where my daughter is right now. So, um, yeah, I mean, I'm trying to, I'm trying to keep my videos up. I'm just telling you, when I work this one to ten shift, I'm just so tired when I get home. Sometimes I fall asleep. Last, last night, the problem was I fell asleep while I was trying to get the video <laughs> uploaded, and it didn't go. So, All right. That's going to be it for me today. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to have tomorrow yet. I haven't done my meal planning for tomorrow. But uh, I'll figure something out. As a matter of fact, if I can stay awake, I might just cook something in, in the air fryer tonight to have it ready to take with me tomorrow. That might be my best bet. So, okay, you guys have a great night, and I will see you tomorrow. Keep on keeping on.